What are we even doing here? Lusus brand sardines in olive oil from Portugal. Lusus, Lucas? It's got that Frenchy looking C that kind of makes an S sound. So because I like going for things, I'm gonna say Lusus. Now uh, these were sent by friend of the files, Austin, who you may remember sent me a few cans several months ago. And this is the last of those to review. So thanks again, Austin, for sending them. I really appreciate it. Justin, AKA the slow jabroni, already reviewed them on his channel a couple of months ago. I've given myself some time to forget everything that he said about them. So what I'm gonna do today is my own fresh opinion, even though I have, I have a, a strong, strong psychic, psychic belief. belief that these are gonna be pretty good. Let's dig in, huh? A nice paper uh, thing, like a bar of soap. Pretty. So you've got like a picture of this lady and she's, um, she's carrying some fish on her head, huh? Yeah. Let's, ooh, oil comes out. I don't, you know, there's no way to like open it without getting the oil out. I know Justin tries not to do it. I kind of give up. Oh my goodness. <sighs> These smell so good. They smell like sardines. I just ate that can of fishwife tuna fish. So my nose is sort of primed for tuna, but now we've switched gears and they're just kind of, I gotta say they're really like chilling in this can, really relaxed. This guy wants to flop over for me. Yeah, he's pretty big. I'm gonna say he doesn't feel quite, he's not a quite as big and firm as a Nuri. Yeah, he's f sort of falling apart here, but that doesn't mean anything. It just means he's falling apart for us. And look what comes right out. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Spine, which is, uh, I don't know. It's like a little appetizer, right? So far, so groovy. Hmm. Mm. The fat part kind of gives pretty good, the fatty bits. Um, it's got a really delicate taste, the fish. They're not, um, they're not seasoned too hard. They're not very salty. But they've got enough flavor that they're kind of speaking through the um, the flavor of the canned tuna that I had a little while ago, that was smoked. So there's sort of this like smoky feeling that I've got that um, that's kind of leaving me now that I got some sardines here. Yeah. Yeah, fish number two. Boy, look at them. boy. Yeah. Yeah, these guys really kind of want to come apart. Really good. Hmm. The easiest thing for me to compare them to is the Nuri's. The Nuri's are so sharp in my mind. I've only had a few cans of Nuri's. The size, the look, the texture of those fish kind of stand out. I mean, I have to say this is this is closer to like the Bellas in style than the Nuri's. They're maybe a half a step up from the Bellas. Yeah. I just had a fish that was kind of the least of the can. He wasn't great. A little mushed out. the last one. Gosh, going kind of quick. That's a good thing. Oh, look how he sort of splits apart. These guys split apart in such an interesting way. They really like 
fall apart along the lines. Just sort of an orderliness to that that I uh, am getting into. Oh, look at that. I don't think I've ever had a spine come out so well. <laughs> wow, this is delicious. There's a napkin. A little bit of a looser, smaller fish than I think I prefer, but it's a nice can to have once a week. And if you happen upon these, I say give them a shot because they're worth it, man. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye. Hey, it's me. I forgot to thank Austin again for the sardines. Thanks, bud. And yeah, check out Slow Jabroni's Lucis video. And on your way out, hit the subscribe button because, you know, why not? You know, I set my account to where all my subscriptions are secret. So you can't see all the Star Wars channels I watch. Bye-bye.